Hello there, my name is Lai San. I would like to talk to you about an artist, Kita Mura Junko. She's a female Japanese ceramic artist, born in 1956, studied at Kyoto City University of Fine Arts under two very famous Japanese artists, Kondo Yutaka and Suzuki Osamu. I would say that Kitamura Junko is heavily influenced by her two teachers. Um, although, if you see her work, you can see how individualistic and how um, unique she is uh, in, as an artist. Um, Kondo Yudaka is actually famous for his form of bunchong wear, his interpretation of uh, Mishima uh, or bunchong. Now, I happen to have a Kitamura Junko vessel. Uh, let me show it to you right now. It's actually a misusashi or a water jar. Kitamura Junko would have used uh, little implements like a bamboo to stamp on the surface of the work before uh, putting a slip over it and then firing it. So the, I'm not concerned about the, uh, the making of the, 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 the vessel throwing um, because I think a lot, of a lot of Japanese ceramic artists are very good at it uh, and it's well known. Uh, they are so respected and revered because of that. Uh, but what I'm concerned about is the tr surface treatment and how she uh, used the patterning and how the design of it and from her own mind and from her imagination and the composition. So it's like painting on a canvas. Uh, um, funny enough, um, the one behind me is a little like that. Uh, it, this painting is actually an Aboriginal art, uh, Aboriginal art, Australian Aboriginal art painting by George Hebrush. Uh, Chungurai from the Western Desert. Uh, you can see it's like an optic uh, painting. Um, not to sidetrack, but I'm just saying, just want to point out that how Kitamura Junko's work are so abstract, uh, using geometric uh, shapes uh, to form the patterning on uh, the surface, which in this case is clay or a ceramic work. But Kitamura Junko has elevated this and has made it into like an art form where it's her works are abstract, very um, detailed, almost uh, done in a meditative way. It blows your mind when you see it.